Here's another example of Trail Engineering's VAC tanker range. I say all our VAC tankers are bespokely built. This one again is different to other ones. Let me show you around this one. So this is on an Aggie style chassis, four tonne gross. You've got a 3,000 litre tank that has been galvanised and it's been painted. Same as the chassis, the chassis has been galvanised and it's been painted. We've had some additions added to it. So the customer's asked for some wheel chocks put on there. So you've got wheel chocks, wheel chock holders. So you can chock it where it's off the vehicle. This is a slow speed um, sight tow trailer. So there's no brakes on it. Although the customer did ask to have lights to put on for moving around sites. So it's got some lights in the back, which I'll show you. So unbrake chassis, chop blocks uh, when it's off the vehicle. Customers asked for a toolbox to be added. So we've got a toolbox there. On the vacuum side of things, you've got a Yamaha L100 diesel engine, electric start, and that's pairing a Mech 2000 vacuum pump uh, via twin belts. And there's a belt guard there, keep it all nice and safe. Battery for the electric start. So there's your ignition switch for the electric start. Starting procedure, I should mention, nice and easy. So to start, just make sure that the fuel tap on the engine is turned into the vertical position. You turn the hair to the rabbit, and then it's just a case of turn the key and away you go. Just remember to select whether you want suction or blow on the um, whether you want to empty the tank or whether you want to fill the tank. Now this customer has asked to add an addition on, which we've mounted on the back of the job. So basically this is going to be used for sucking up uh, flood water and then it's going to be pumped into a storage tank. But the problem the customer had was that he needs to pump eight meters vertically into a storage tank. So we've added a Yamaha electric start diesel engine again which is going to pump the water out of the tank eight meters vertically into a storage facility so a battery again for the electric starts put a valve system on the back of the tank so you can either choose to for the pump to empty the tank so you'll just open this valve and then the contents will go out of the tank through the pump and then you can pump it out or you can open this valve and then that will discharge it out via gravity feed or you can pressurise the tank and push it out via the two inch outlet on there on the bottom. So we've added hoses, so when you want to use the pump to pump it out, connect your hoses onto your storage facility via a connector. We've put an isolation valve there as well, so you can switch the isolation valve off and then again on the suction side of things, we've put 15 metres of Tiger Tail hose, suction wand with a quick release connector. So if you want to extend your hoses, just add another hose with another cam lock on there. You can connect that up there. As I said before, the customer's asked for lights, although this is a sight tail job, he's got lights in a protective channel there. And then moving around, as I say, everything's bespoke. This customer has also asked for a mast. So this is a telescopic mast. And uh, the customer's going to put floodlights on there. So when they're working at night, they can just simply open that up, pump it up, and extend the mast. So when you're finished, you can just let the air out of the system. Mast will come back down again. So that's just a nice little addition that the customer's asked for that we've accommodated. A filtration system, so any oil that might be in the air as it's going through the vac pump, it'll be collected in the first uh, filter. Secondary filter is full of medical charcoal, so that'll take away any smells, and then it just exhausts through there. So again, customer's asked for a little bit more different specification, we've catered for it. With the mast, filters, as I say, all different chassis we can do, we can do highway tow, site tow, skid base. And that's about it for the walk around of Trail Engineering's 3000 litre Aggie style bespoke build. Don't forget to watch our other videos on YouTube and check out our website trailengineering.co.uk. Thanks for watching.